It's very impressive that um, he came to a point in his life where he said, I've really made it uh, big in this country. I've done a lot. I've had a lot of success. Um, it's time for me to take uh, a little bit of what I know and what I can do and give that back to my community. Goya created the Hispanic Achievement Award because we felt there was a need to bring to the forefront the successes of all the Hispanic groups here in the United States. And what better uh, group to work with than the Spain U.S. Chamber of Commerce? perfect example of what an immigrant can do. He came from uh, Colombia with nothing and uh, he's made it a successful business. He's been an amazing person and given back. The most important thing is he's always focused on mentoring others and giving back to the community and now he's also able to help kids that are in the same position that he was in at one point and I think that's what uh, it's all about. The Spain-U.S. Chamber of Commerce is truly honored to host this prestigious event, which would not be possible without the support of Goya Foods and the entire Unanue family. Tonight it is an honor to recognize a leader like Henry Cardenas, whose work has advanced the mission for which the Goya Hispanic Achievement Award was created. Henry Cardenas is the biggest producer of Latin music concerts in the United States. He is considered by Billboard magazine as one of its top Latin power players. But more importantly, he is a leader in the Hispanic community and a champion of social justice and solidarity. To see these kids go from looks of despair and sadness to expressions of hope, health, and love. It really is just amazing. And it's because of the heart, the vision, and the ded dedication of Henry that these kids have a chance for a better future. And this is why we are here tonight honoring this man. Quiero darle las gracias a alguien que está ausente esta noche, a mi hermano Marc Anthony, por ser el cómplice de esta obra, de esta labor que estamos haciendo. Gracias a mi familia, a la familia Goya, que siempre está con nosotros, cada que hemos hecho un llamado, dicen presente, Rafael, Bab y todos los integrantes de esta compañía, saben lo que es la necesidad en Latinoamérica. Finalmente quiero exhortar a cada uno de ustedes en esta sala a colocar un granito de arena en lo que se necesita, no solamente en Latinoamérica, sino aquí en los Estados Unidos. Un granito de arena se coloca ayudando a un niño, a una niña, a ser alguien, a ser profesional, a ser psicólogo, pelotero profesional. No tienen que ser 200, 300, 400 personas que ayuden, solamente con una. Y si usted lo hace, usted ha cumplido la labor. Gracias por la oportunidad. <música>